I interrupt the intro to inform you that this was our last day in Mexico. I decided to film a quick house tour before we left, so let's move on with the tour. Play the intro. This is one of the main entrance. It leads you to the dining room, and this is the other entrance, which takes you to the living room, but we don't really use that one. To the side entrance right here, and it leads you to the backyard. And this is the upstairs. This is the chimney it comes from all the way downstairs it passes through the upstairs floor or the ceiling from the bottom floor whatever you want to call it and then it goes all the way up and this is my view this is the view you get from up here that's where the water is stored and this is a huge antenna that i don't think we use anymore this is one room And in this room, it's the first room you walk into, the whole wall is a big window. So if you were to open the curtains up, you can see outside. And if you open these doors, you can go out into the balcony. Now, I'm not going to open these doors right now because it's really hard to close them. But I will jump over from there. I'll jump over outside and into the balcony and show you that view. But let me show you this other room first. Now here is another door, and it leads you to the second room. This is the second room. Yeah, you see that's Diana right there when she was in middle school? You see it? Now let's go over and let me show you the balcony. I am now on the balcony. I jumped this little fence right here. It's very narrow, but it'll do. And the, these are the doors that lead into the room that I, I was just in. And over here is the window to the second room. And this is my view from up here. Let's go into what's going to be my room, which is not a lot. It's just a big empty room and the lights don't work. In the outside bathroom, it's just, you know, a bathroom. We've had it pretty much like this for a couple of years now. And there's really not else much to see. The laundry room. We only have a washer. There is no dryer because we have a clothesline to air dry the clothes. And we also have this one. It's a lavadero. I don't, I'm not sure what you call it in English. Over here is the garage. This is where we keep the vehicles. Billard room, whatever you want to call it. That's where my dad and his brothers play pool. Those are all the sticks right there. And as long as I can remember, they've had this map, and I'm not sure why. Still don't know why. It's a map of Alaska. I guess I just wanted it for decoration or something. If you enter through the front, this is the first room you go into, which is the dining room. We don't really eat here unless we have guests or we have dinners or any get-together. This is where all, almost all the guests eat. And my mom pretty much covered everything up with plastic because we're about to leave tomorrow. And she doesn't like any dust getting on them. The TV's also covered over there, but we'll show you that later. Then, if you go straight, this is the kitchen. Again, we're cleaning up because we're leaving, so just ignore the mess. But this is the kitchen. That's covered up in plastic, too. They moved the fridge because they're going to make a doorway right here to go into my room. To the right is the living room. I'm not part of the living room. Over here, we have the chimney that we haven't really used yet but we will we had we only we've only had the chimney for about a year or a year and a half or so not that long and over here we have all of my dad's soccer trophies because he used to play soccer so much in his younger days but again that's covered up with plastic and these are some of his pictures
over here is like the main living room or the other part of the living room. This is where we sit and watch TV. That's over here. It's also covered up in plastic. There's a little coffee table where we have the remotes and everything. Those are covered with trash bags, which are the lamps. And through this little opening right here, this little window, you can see towards the first room that you see when you walk in, which is a dining room. In here, we only have one bedroom downstairs for now, and it's my parents' room. This is the master bedroom. And if you walk over here, you will see the inside bathroom. We only have two bathrooms, and it's the inside bathroom and the outside bathroom. We, it hasn't been very long that we've had this inside bathroom, maybe like two years or a year and a half. And it's pretty small, but it'll do because we wanted one inside and this is what we got. So my last full day in Mexico has come to an end. I'm really upset about it because I don't want to leave, but I have to because so many fun things happening. I will get to that in a bit. But I did film film a house tour. It wasn't as good as I wanted it to be. I still felt rushed and I didn't do it very thoroughly. And it got dark outside. And okay, the reason I could stay longer, but I can't because today is Wednesday. We leave tomorrow, Thursday, because and we arrive on Friday. And on Saturday, I have I have to go to a concert. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to a concert with my comadre, Nancy. Yeah, she's been to my vlogs before. Um, and we're going to a concert together. We're going to go see Selena Gomez. I'm so excited. I have no idea how much of a big fan I am. Ever since I was a little human. Well, ever since she was on Wizards of Waverly Place. And I've been a fan ever since, like, 2007, 2008. I think it was 2008, actually. And... I'm 18 now. <laughs> I've been a fan for like nearly 10 years and I did go to her Hi Abel. I did go see her in concert in her last tour which was a Stars Dance tour back in 2013 and um, I got those tickets last minute so I couldn't find any good ones and I was all the way up there with Jesus Christ like the very very top seats and I loved it even though we were so high I still loved it and on Saturday, we have front row seats. Okay, so let me explain this further. Hold on. We we had like the, the pit seats. There aren't any seats. It's standing up. You have close, very close to the stage, but it's first come, first serve. So if you're the first in line, you get way closer to the stage. And we want to be there. We want to be first, obviously. Everybody wants to be first. Hopefully, we do get some good seats. And... We're also going to Puerto Rico for a week, like 22nd, I think, through the 29th, so I'm really excited. Yay, we're leaving today, and we're doing some very, very last-minute shopping. We got... Yeah, cookie! Yeah, mom! Well, well. Oh, the dog? Let's zoom in on him. Yeah, well, 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 well. And I don't really want to leave, but I know I have to because I have so many more fun things to do, and especially on Saturday. Let's look at about that. My mom's back. so we can put back all of the luggage and my mom went with my cousin to get permission because she has a visa vean nanita nanita mira 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 el ay say hi
I found another baby. This is Froyo. Hi, Froyo. His name is Froilan, but we call him Froyo. Okay, I'll get you up. Hold on. Prestasela. Oh, I haven't said anything before, but my parents left me here because they're going to the concert tomorrow. Oh, are you ready? And my comadre is here. Who's that? Don't take me to the restroom, Mom.